Hey guys, it's Colin here at eTrailer and today we have a 2019 Infiniti QX80 and we're going to be test fitting the Titan Chain Alloy Snow Tire Chains. Now the tire size on our Infiniti today is on the sidewall, so it's over here. We got 275-60R20, so just double check and make sure that your tire size is going to match the fitment of the chains. Now it's always a good idea to have a set of chains in your QX80 uh, for any of those uh, weather situations for snow or ice that you might encounter, especially if you live in an area where multiple times throughout the winter months you're gonna be getting a really heavy dose of snow and ice. These Titan chains are gonna be very durable, be able to give you that extra traction you need so you don't slide off of the road. Now there's two things I really like about these Titan chains in particular. One of them being that they're super easy to install. We don't have to lay underneath the tire, make any connections like a ladder pattern chain. And the other thing I like about them is that they're self-tensioning. So we have this self-tensioning system built in to the chain, helps keep our tire chains snug on our tire so they're not clanking around at all while we're driving. Now these chains are going to have a diamond pattern design and they get that name from this diamond shape they make on the tire with the cross links right here. Now that diamond pattern just gives you more coverage around your tire and thus is just going to give you better traction than a ladder pattern style chain would. Now with these square links that you can see right here, these are going to dig into that snow and ice and it's going to give you the traction and that bite that you need and those weather situations to make sure that you have good traction. Now these chains do have a speed rating of 30 miles per hour, so make sure you're keeping it slow out there. We're also gonna get them in a quantity of two, so you get them for the rear of your Infiniti. This is a rear wheel drive vehicle, so make sure you're installing it on the back. However, I do wanna point out, if you have four wheel drive on your Infiniti and you wanna have stuff for the front tires, just use the same part number. And like I said, quantity of two comes in this nice durable case that makes for very easy storage when they're not in use. And something else I always suggest is whenever you get your chains, no matter if it's these Titan chains or whatever set of chains you decide to go with, get them out, practice with them a little bit, install them on your Infinity before you go out in the weather. That way, if you find yourself in a situation of snow or ice, you know exactly how to get them on and you know how to work through any problems that you might run into. Now I'm gonna walk you through that install right now. Now the first thing you want to do is lay your chains out and then you just want to check them over for any kinks or twists in the links or any tangles, make sure you get all that out. Uh, after you use them for a while, you probably at some point do want to start checking for broken links just in case. Now these are should last you a long time and with these being brand new, we don't have to worry about that right now. So what I'm going to do is just slide them behind my tire to start. Once you kind of pull it all the way through, it's a good idea to just align it up underneath your tire right there and do the same for both sides. Now from here, you want to take both sides of your cable, bring it up behind your tire and connect it. From there, you can just kind of tuck that cable behind your tire and then pull your chains over the top and sides, just like that. Now on the top, we need to make the first connection. You can see we have these uh, three yellow links right here. Uh, this is a uh, variant on the size of your tire. Like I said with this Infinity, we're just going to go ahead and go to the third one just to make sure we get a snug fit on our tire. If you do go with the third one and you find that it's too tight, just kind of backtrack a little bit and move to either the second or the first one. Now we'll transition down to the bottom of the chain. You can see we have this long gray chain right here. What we're going to do is kind of feed that through this red channel. We're just gonna pull up on it until we get a link to lock into that channel. And then we'll feed the excess through these red loops. And then from here, what we wanna do is follow the yellow links as far as we can and put this hook on the furthest one. This is gonna activate the self-tensioning system. Let's see if I can get up here. Looks like we'll have to just backtrack a little right there. Now, you can see we have a nice snug fit with our chains. So from here, what you wanna do is repeat the process for the other side. Now, once you've got both chains installed, it's not a bad idea to drive forward 
and then get out and take a look at your chain just to make sure that they are still on securely. From there, you're ready to hit the road. Well, thank you all for watching, but that's going to do it for our test fit of the Titan Chain Alloy Snow Tire Chains on our 2019 Infinity QX80.